What's going on guys? My name is TJP and welcome back to another NBA 2K23 My NBA Rebuilding Challenge and it is another 82-0 challenge here with the top 10 shooting guards of all time according to NBA 2K23's all-time teams. Uh, so if you're enjoying the content, leave a like, subscribe, uh, comment down below some of my videos, go to socials, playlist, second channel, main channel, all down below in the description if you like other content be TJP. And, um, yeah, let's uh, show you guys the roster before we start simulating and uh, get on to the gameplay. As I previously mentioned, uh, both uh, in this video as well as the previous video with the all-time players, is that it's going to be based on the all-time teams, so no current players are here. Uh, just the all-time versions of, you know, the players. Obviously, James Harden's here, but, you know, it's an all-time version of him. So, so, yeah, anyways, we got Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant, Dwayne Wade, Clyde Drexler, James Harden, David Thompson, Chris McGrady, Ray Allen, Mitch Richmond, Pete Maravich, and I think that's it. Yeah, those are your top 10. So, if the point guards were pretty good, I feel like the shooting guards should also be pretty good. They've got a little bit more height, uh, average height-wise. Um, I mean, the tallest player is going to be Tracy McGrady. So, I mean, it's 6'8", but our shortest guy is only 6'4". So that's not terrible. Um, so, we'll see how good this team can be. And I put them on the Spurs because, yes. So I'm going to fix up the rotation since this isn't quite right. So let me do that and show you guys what we're going to be rocking with. All right, so here's the rotation I decided to go with. So we've got James Harden, Kobe Bryant, Michael Jordan, Clyde Drexler, Tracy McGree is my starting five. Dwayne Wade's coming off the bench with David Thompson, Ray Allen, B. Maravich, and Mitch Richmond. It's a pretty solid rotation, I think. Uh, is it good enough to go 82 now? That remains to be seen. We're going to simulate and find out right now. So the first game, and we start off with a win. So, good stuff there from the all-time shooting guards. Michael Jordan lead the way in scoring. Kobe Bryant, 9 of 12. Good, efficient scoring game. Five turns a little too high, but, you know, he was still really solid. And everybody uh, scored. T-back as a center. is going to be kind of tough. He had eight assists, though, which is kind of cool. Uh, James Harden led the team in rebounding, surprisingly, as a point guard. Eh, surprising. Uh, we have somehow out-rebounded the Hornets. I guess they're just not a very good rebounding team. So, there you go. That's going to be the thing. Rebounding is key. Can we grab enough boards... To collect W. So far, we're starting the season 10 and 0. That's a good start. I don't know when we're gonna get our first loss, but it's uh, you know a foregone. It's not a foregone conclusion that we will lose, but I would assume that we will get a loss at some point. So far, though, 22 and 0, and um, yeah, 24 and 0 now can make it 25 wins. Got the Rockets on the schedule, and we do beat them. So this shooting guard team is off to a fantastic start. 28 and 0, 29 and 29 and 0. Make it 30 wins on the season so far. And yeah, who do you guys think is going to have the best team? Let me know down in the comments below. Ready to the point guards. If you missed that video, check it out on my channel. I uploaded that yesterday. Uh, so yeah, check it out. And yeah, 40 0 right now, halfway through the season. And yeah, we've we haven't lost a game yet. This team is very imp looking very impressive right now. 45 0, 46 0. Yes indeed. And can we get to 50 wins? And we do, without a loss so far. This all-time shooting guard team is looking really solid, I gotta say. Uh, I don't know how, but yeah, wow, they're beating teams by a very wide margin. Uh, but, you know, you never know, we could always catch an L. Uh, I saw a game where they see 133 points, that's a lot of points. 60 wins on the season so far, not a single loss right now. At the contract extension, still undefeated, and no signs of slowing down right now. 66 wins, 67. Can they get to 70? They do. Um, and, I, and I didn't even change the system proficiency. I forgot to do that. Uh, maybe I'll do that for the playoffs. Uh, are they going to win every single... Uh, no way. And they go undefeated. Wow. The top 10 all-time... Shooting guards went undefeated. Now, I wonder how much coach it plays. In, uh, coach comes into play. Maybe it does. Uh, here are your awards in case you're curious. D Wade, six man of the year for our team. 13 points a game, 4.6 rounds, 6.6 .6 assists on a uh, very good efficiency. So, and he also played good D. It's a fair play to Dwayne Wade. Greg Popovich, obviously a coach of the year, which makes a lot of sense. Uh, here's your All NBA first, second, and third. Not a single spur on here. For all of our efforts, we don't even get an All-NBA player. We get an All-Defensive team from Michael Jordan. 17 points a game, almost 6 rebounds and 6 assists. About nearly 2 steals a game. 
So it makes sense why he made all defense. And yeah, very solid efficiency from the field. So good stuff there from Michael Jordan. And also Dwayne Wayne made all the best second team as well. Everybody else did not make anything. So clearly we're going to be the number one seed. Now let's take a look at assist proficiency. Was it our best? Four and a half D? We were playing defense as our best. Which I guess works for this team, except for James Harden. We might as well do balanced. Yeah, let's do balanced. That way, yeah, they're be it's a better fit system-wise. I mean, they we were playing great defense anyway, so not like it was too bad. But uh, we're going to stick with that in the in the playoffs. So 82-0. Great stuff there from the team. Now, can they continue to go undefeated in the playoffs? Well, we're going to find out. But let's take a look at the scoring leaders and the stats and all of that. Eight guys average double figures. Practically everybody on the team nearly had 10 points a game. Uh, nearly nine, so it was very close. Uh, if, maybe if we gave Mitch a little bit more PT, possibly we can get all 10 players to score 10. Actually, that should be a challenge. Can we get every single player in our rotation to average 10 points a game? That would be a very good challenge. Hmm. Uh, but anyways, that, yeah, let me know down in the comments if you want to see that. Uh, yeah, Clyde Jackson led team rebounding. Assist was Tracy McGrady playing our center position. That's kind of interesting. Dan Dwayne Wade, Kobe Bryant. Actually, pretty good on the uh, uh, facilitation. I think... I don't even think we had a point guard that had over seven assists. Uh, no, I think... No, we definitely did. We surely did. Surely. There's no way we didn't, right? Six guys leads to steal a game. Mike Drone nearly two. Block shots. Two guys leads to block a game. Plus for scores, David Thompson. Nobody shot below 50% of the field. Nobody shot below 35 from three. James Harden was the best there. And our best free throw shooter was Pete Maravich. 50-40-90 uh, for James as well. And yeah, our worst three free throw shooter was Tracy McGrady at 78.3%. That's pretty good. So, I would assume we should be okay. Um, yeah, I mean, we should be able to beat every team in the playoffs. I mean, this is the Nuggets. Nothing too significant. Let's just sim the round. And we swapped them. So, there you go. Golden State lost to the Grizzlies they got swept and we're taking on the Grizzlies tough team but you know we should be able to beat them let's see if we can and we swept them Pelicans they've had two seven game series fighting hard getting through but I don't know can they beat this team let's find out nope sweep Kobe Bryant Western Conference Finals MVP and we got the Celtics, Jason Tatum. So they were, uh, this is their team. They got Vucevic, I guess now. Gallinari's back. And Butter than ever. Blake Griffin, Mike Scala now. Grant Williams, Al Horford, Derek White. Patrick Beverly's on the team. Although I'm pretty sure he's going to re-sign with the Bulls. I guess that's just not, or he plans to sign with the Bulls. Uh, but let's see if we can beat them. Game one is a Spurs win. Game two, we win. They win game three. And the perfect, immaculate season. 82-0 in the regular season and 60-0 in the playoffs. The shooting guards, the top 10 shooting guards of all time, have gone 82-0. And it's because of this man right here in the finals, Tracy McGrady. This guy's a sim cheat code, uh, which is... Uh, He's one of, the, one of my favorite guys uh, in this game. He's really good. Larry Bird's really good also in the sim. Uh, those are definitely guys that like I try to go after when we do, you know, our specific rebuilds, right, in different eras. Uh, and as you can see, Trace McGilley led the team in points per game. Only got to average tw at least 20. We had eight guys in double figures again. Your leading rebounder was Clyde Drexler. Uh, also led the team in assist. Had five guys at least to steal a game. Three got four guys at least a block shot. Most switch score was Tracy McGrady, but also James Harden, David Thompson. Shot about the same efficiency. Three point shooting uh, was uh, Michael Jordan, but he didn't take too many. But when he did take them, he made them. So did Tracy McGrady. Oh my goodness. And then yeah, free throw shooting. Some insane efficiency here. 50 40 90. 50 50 90 for Mitch Richmond. 60 50. And like almost 90, that's pretty insane. And then 50, 60, almost 90. 
for friggin' Michael Jordan. 60-40. I mean, like, so much great efficiency from this team. Yeah. The... There you go. I mean, the top 10 shooting guards of all time, according to NBA 2K, by rating, they are dominant. They are a dominant force to be reckoned with. So, yeah, I guess that answers the question. Can they go to E2 now? Yes, they can. And they went 16 now in the playoffs. So, with that being said, full screen, close of the video. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for me. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like button and subscribe. If you're not subscribed already, comment down below the video. Today. Let's go to our socials, playlist, second channel, and main channel down in the description if you like other content from TJP. Again, we're going to be doing this for small forwards, power forwards, and centers as well. So be on the lookout for that very shortly. With that being said, take care, everybody. See you soon. And peace.